think our veterans who fought for our country, gave their lives, deserve to sit on shelves in a tin can in a, in a cardboard box? That's why we do it. Veterans take care of veterans. One brother is not going to ever forget another brother. And that's what this is all about. We gather today to provide the greatest honor which can be bestowed upon a deceased veteran of the United States military. And that is a formal and honorable burial. We are provided the opportunity to see that these cremated remains of 10 of our brother veterans are buried and properly memorialized for all to appreciate. This land called America is free today because of the brave who have fought to keep that freedom. William Tillark. A gentleman by the name of William Tillark was born in Bayonne, New Jersey in the year 1877. That would have made him 24 years old when he joined the United States Navy and fought in the Spanish-American War from 1901 through 1905. Bill was a shipfitter, petty officer, first class. For the next world wars and dozens of conflicts, William Tillard lived in Oradell until the time of his death, August 20th, 1948. I mean, that gentleman was born in 1877. He's been on this earth three centuries waiting to be put back to the earth. Uh, and this will bring our total to 178 veterans that we've taken off the shelf and buried in Brigadier General Goyle Cemetery. So it's a big closure for us and for our veterans. To be perfectly honest, years ago, um, I'm not sure how everything went when someone passed. Um, I'm sure you got your local funeral director and worked things out. Um, unfortunately, it appears that some families never returned to pick up their loved ones. And that's what New Jersey Mission of Honor is all about. There are veterans throughout the state of New Jersey that have been orphaned and abandoned, and that's what we do. We work with the funeral directors, get the job done, and get the veterans interred at Brigadier General William C. Doyle Cemetery in Arneytown. Prepare to fire. 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 Port. Arm. Stand and preserve. Right, left, face. As a veteran, it's it's my duty to pay my respects to these uh, veterans, other veterans, longtime veterans that have passed away. These remains have remained on the shelf way too long, unclaimed, unknown. So now they're, they're getting their, uh, their time due. I know some of these men probably passed without a family or something like that with nobody to claim them. So the veterans claim them and the veterans will take them down to make sure that they get the proper burial that they deserve by serving their country. I just have a lot of respect for the people that do this and uh, who take care of the veterans. It's an important thing to do. They served our country and deserve this. And it's no fault of theirs that they have been left sitting on a shelf collecting dust. And just to see that people care, citizens, our country, surrounding neighbors, it's very moving.